hi guys welcome again let's make plantain musa this is a ripe plantain overripe plantain and pepper um i just added onions and water to blend you know you have to add liquid into this for it to be able to blend so this is me blending the plantain the overripe plantain pepper and onions you blend it into until it is smooth very smooth you know the way we used to make akara the process is the same so blend until it is very smooth So after blending this is how your paste should look like and you make sure that it is very smooth just like this then this is half spoon of salt that i just added mix everything together mix it into the paste mix it together because you don't want to take a chunk of salt um after frying your musa then when this is done this is baking um soda you mix again mix everything properly you can see how i'm adding the um dry ingredients one after the other you don't mix it you don't add everything together you mix one after the other after salt baking soda and the next one is to add um flour so this is the flour i'll be using but i'm not adding everything at once i'm going to add it bit by bit first and second so that how it will actually you know be easier to control how the paste is So this is how um, the consistency should be after adding all the dry ingredients. This is how it should look like after mixing everything and it is time to start frying. You just start dropping the butter into the hot oil. Just, you know, the, the exact way we do fry akara or puff puff. This is how you should be dropping it into the hot oil. You have to fry it until it is golden brown. Um, I like it very crunchy. 
So I'm going to take my time in frying it. Now it has fried to my taste and the next thing to do is to take it out from the hot oil just as I am doing. So just um, repeat the process until your paste is actually finished if you have overripe plantain you know those kind of plantain that um you cannot actually fry because of how soft they are you can actually use it to make mosa i love mosa so much anytime i buy like small shops or i attend an event and they share small shops the only thing i eat from there is mosa and puff puff so try and make your mosa and i love when my mosa is spicy that is the kind of mosa that i love so guys if you have watched up to this moment and if today is actually your first time of coming across my channel my name is favor i am a youtuber based in lagos nigeria and to my returning subscribers you guys are so so special to me this is the outcome of it and i love it so much thank you so much for always watching thank you so much for always commenting this is so beautiful and it's tasted yummy and crunchy as well thank you and i will see you in my next one bye bye